Hello everyone, I'm Chester44 and welcome to this let's play of Greedfall. Last episode, we decided to finally go and speak with the people who would hopefully be able to do something to ease Constantine's pain. Well, we did find one and managed to get help from them, but the healer in Wenshavai is... There's some problems going on in the village that we need to handle. Turns out that uh, the native Tenlens have gotten a lot more aggressive, there's some missing children, and they're having problems with the missionaries, so we need to do something about all of that. First thing I want to do, though, go over to the Wenshavai camp. For two reasons. One, I need to do a little crafting to uh, fix something of someone. Vindwal's Antidote, that is not something we need to work with. No, no, that's something we dealt with before. Wait, then how do we... Okay, hold on. Gather the companions. Because we need to swap out Petrus again. Remove Afra, take Petrus. Let me take... The blacksmith's gloves. Okay, I guess maybe we need to tell... We need to travel again. I'm guessing maybe we need to wear this in order to uh, fix it for him. Because we need to fix his weapon. It's not working. Oh, it's right here. Repair Craftsmanship 1. Do not have the required talent level? I will in a moment. Here Perfect. is your weapon. It has been made new. Thank you. You have given it back its purpose. It belonged to my master before me, and you have understood its nature. It may be that you are more on Almanawi than Renaitse, and that you will one day see as we. During my walks, I saw a great turn of clear skin. The others seemed to follow him. I felt that he called them, that he fed them rage, and that his place is not here. Why didn't you try to kill it? He is very strong, and the others protect him. I was only able to track him to his lair, a cavern. I placed traps all around it, but all were avoided. He is clever. You say he doesn't have his place here. What do you mean? That he was brought here. To attract the others and make them rage. By men. The Renaik say. But I cannot prove this. That is why I did not wish to voice these thoughts. I feel it. Nothing more. Hmm. Uh, speak about the missing fisherman, if you don't mind. The brother of the young fisherman told me that you do not get along. We have had arguments from time to time, but they were of no importance. This boy is too quick to anger. He does not have the calm of a good hunter of fish. And you didn't try to rid yourself of him? Of course not. None of our kind would do such a thing. I must be going. Bit accusatory. I don't think I would normally say something like that. Okay. So, we do have one over here, the Tenlin's Nest. But I feel like we need to uh, wait for Dawn to do some of these fights. Also, uh, I do want to speak with this guy again, see if he has anything to say. Where was he? He was to the north here. There he is. Well, on all Manawi, have you found my brother? Not yet, but I will. Speak about other victims. Did your brother know the other girl who disappeared? Yes. It is because of that girl that he fought with the Moin Shakers. Could she be the source of his happiness of late? I don't think so. They have been friends since they were little. But she is promised to another. A promise can be broken. 
And it might be the reason your brother has kept it secret. Perhaps. But what would it matter? He would not have fled with her. Not without saying farewell. Mm. I must be leaving. It seems our two tell. missing youths were together here. No need for a seer to see that there must have been something more than friendship between them. It doesn't seem like we have anything else here, so... I'm going to go up to the camp, wait till dawn, and then go hunt these things. Because all we have right now are... Ah, find the missing villagers. They'd be over there by... the gloomy lair. Goody. I mainly wait- oh great, more creatures to kill. You freeze! Dead. All right. Camp is to the north here, I think. No, it's to the west of where we are right now. There it is. All right, we'll rest till dawn. Now then, let's start hunting. Now there's one to the south here. I think it's a clearing. And we're about to level up. Probably once we clear out this last uh, nest. Which will be very nice. That is not the way we go. Can I get through here? I can. Given the presence of the tendons in this clearing, there must be a nest not far from here. There we go, we got our level up. The ideal moment. I must kill the dominant one before destroying the nest. I think I did. I think it was a big green one. Nope, there's more over here, surprisingly. Oh no, that white one is the is the uh is the big one. All right, the dominant ones have the horns. Okay, dominant ones dealt with. Okay, that's one, and we can kill a couple more of these right here. You, I don't ow. They're dealt with. Good. So I know I leveled up for a second there. Did I get anything? All we have is a single skill point. I can't get two-handed heavy weapons. I should have bought one. Hmm. I guess we'll work our way up here. Okay. So, one is dealt with. Still got two more we need to deal with. Which 
should have enough alchemical preparations, right? We don't. We only have, like, one of them. Okay. We'll pick up a couple more out of our, uh, out of our box. Fortunately, we can do that. Here we are. Uh, I don't need 21. I'll grab five. There we go. And I can probably put some of these potions in. That works. I think because I've been looting less things, uh, in certain locations. Ow, ow! I don't have as many potions. I really should get a bigger mace. I mean, I can! Healing. Okay, there we go. Now, moving onwards. We are near water, in the area the fisherman's brother mentioned. A nest must be close to here. There really are a lot of tentacles around here. Ah, and we did actually find it. The ideal moment. I must kill the dominant one before destroying the nest. It's gonna pop up in a moment. There we go. Dominant one's dealt with. And the rest are dealt with. Excellent. Now we run north to get the third one. I think. Yeah. Way up there. Well, these were dying very quickly and easily. Glad for that, at least. That one is definitely... Oh, bandits. Okay, that's a bunch of random bandits who are here who are now dead. Claymore of the Prince's Guard? I don't care about that. going north before the end of dawn how much longer do we have anyway I think it's no longer dawn go to dawn again
Okay, they're dealt with. Now, cross this bridge. The hunter told me that I would find a nest in this area. Looked like it was up here. Wow. I must kill the dominant one before destroying the nest. Indeed. And there it is. Protect me in this battle. May the shadow engulf our enemies. Dominant one's dead. And the rest are all dead. Okay. The third nest is destroyed. The Master Hunter will be relieved to hear it, I'm sure. Oh, most certainly. We're not done yet. You can find the missing villagers nearby. So let's go get to them. says that they're around here. You don't suppose they went into the cave, do you? Uh-oh. That cavern seems home to some creatures. Let's be wary. It could very well be the lair of that great Tenman the hunter spoke of. It could indeed. by his clothing, he was a missionary. The two others are more recent. A man and a woman. Our missing couple, no doubt. They were dragged here and devoured alive. Oh, what a tragic fate. Oh my. Hilarious. The es his name is Hilarious? Be especially prudent bringing the large white tenlin inside this cave. It is terribly ferocious and the other beasts obey its orders. Our whole plan depends on it, so try not to become another of its victims. I cannot believe that these missionaries use such a ruse to achieve their goals. Two youths died because of them. Now you understand why some of us fight against the Rinaigse. Their words are always sweet, but all they bring is death. Well, Petrus, do you have any defense for this? We need to go and speak with the missionaries immediately. Probably could have dr spoken with them before, but this? No. We are getting rid of them. Oh no, we still need to destroy the White Tenlin's nest. Sure, we killed the White Tenlin, but we didn't kill his nest. My mistake.
right here. Oh shit! I think we found the white tentland. I think we killed the white tentland. Okay. to the village. Their families need to be informed. Indeed. First things first, we're going to talk to the missionaries and get rid of them. Let's get out of here. Why would you name someone hilarious? They're not Roman! It's the only time I would consider naming someone hilarious to be accepted. Yeah, first things first, we're going to deal with the missionaries here. So we found what you were doing. Where did you come from? All oh, right, we had to rest. They probably respawn simply because of us resting. Yeah, yeah, getting a little bit of loot. Right, back to running down to deal with the missionaries. Just gotta get around to them. Oh, great, more of these creatures. Great, moving on. I'm not even gonna bother looting them. This should be an easy way to get there. Indeed. Alright, Petrus, you're with us. Maybe you can help us get rid of these people quickly. Good day. I'm the legate of the Congregation of Merchants on this isle. Might I ask you a few questions? Of course. Our allies from the continent are always welcome among us. What do you want to know? Let's ask them about their mission here first. Could you tell me what your mission here is? We must return these lost souls to the light and guide them so that they might receive the revelation. We have constructed the perfect village, Eden, where they might discover peace in this protected paradise. They can receive divine teachings and join the illuminated chosen people. What are the Tenlins attacking the village? Have you heard about the Tenlin attacks on the village? I didn't know those creatures were given that name, but yes, we have heard talk about the attacks. We offered them our help and some comfort in their most difficult hour. In exchange uh -huh. for some inspiring conversation, I suppose. Of course. These horrible beasts have most certainly been sent by the demons of this isle. Demons to chase of the only isle. a few away right. would be of no use. If they truly desire peace, they must see the light. You haven't been victim of these attacks? On occasion, yes. But thanks to the illuminated, we were able to chase them away with little effort. Well... Asked about the connection between Tenlins and you demons. You seem to assert that the attacks of these Tenlins is somehow linked to the demons on the isle. Whereas these are creatures that the natives have always known. They nest beside them. These are familiar beasts, but hasn't anyone informed you that their patterns have changed? These creatures have been riled up by the demons of the island, who have come to realize we are near victory. Sending them against these poor people they maintain them in a state of fear and obedience to their shaman healer. 
There is only one way to truly make these attacks cease, my child. Convert these people. Defeat these demons. The Denegar of this village wishes for you to depart. You disturb the tranquility of their village. And you expect us to obey him? Haven't you understood that he is a servant of the island's demons? To leave would be to abandon the simplistic souls of all those that follow him, ceding victory to the demons. No, my child. We will not leave this place until the light shines over every dwelling. Well, how about I if I fought against, against the great them. number of tenants? One that was quite spectacular. A great white beast. Its mere presence seemed to aggravate the others, attract them and make them aggressive. A beast sent by the demons, no doubt. But... Stop taking me for a fool. We also found a journal detailing your vicious plan. I have only one piece of advice to give you. Leave, and quickly. Or the Mother Cardinal will learn every detail of your manipulations. We shall be leaving as soon as possible. But let it be known that you are abandoning all of these poor souls to damnation. Perhaps you should be more concerned about your own soul, sister. People have died by your fault. Precisely. Now, with that taken care of, let us go back and report into the families on the sad loss of those two. Fortunately, I can do a quick teleport to get there. Let's do this. To the village. Boom. Let's see, one was up to the north here. The other was to the south. Well, Onol Manawi, have you found my brother? I found him, but I'm truly sorry your brother is dead. May the earth welcome him. I felt it. How did it come to pass? He knew every stone on our lands. It couldn't have been an accident. He had a liaison with a young girl from the village. They would meet in a clearing, and they must have forgotten the hour. Night took them by surprise, and a tenlan crossed their path. I found both of them in the cavern of the beast. How oh, terrible. Why did he go to see the girl in secrecy? They could have... I must recover his body. To give it up to the earth, as is our custom. Where is it? With the body of the girl he loved, in a cavern near the clearing. But it is a dangerous place. Other Tenlands might still be roaming there. Though I did kill quite a few. I have a duty owed to my little brother. Thank you, Onol Manawi. I will not forget this. I must be leaving. Now let us inform the girl's sister. It is sad that this happened to pass in this way. Do you have any news? Do you know where my sister is? Yes. I'm truly very sorry. Oh no. Nah. Sir Tonsidag, please do not tell me that she is dead. I found her body in the lair of the Great Tenlin, not far from the clearing. But how could she have been surprised by the beasts? She knew the danger. She went out to meet the young fisherman. The time must have flown by into the night. I'm so sorry. We found them both dead. I must bring her body back to carry out the rite. You should not go alone. I killed as many as I could, but it would be better to be prudent. I shall follow your counsel on Ol Manawi. Two deaths are enough. Thank you. Thank you. I must leave now. The nests are destroyed, and with the death of the White Tenland, the attacks should cease. And we are even able to convince the missionaries to leave. Katasak should be willing to follow us now. Let's go and find him. Indeed.
However, I believe we shall speak with him in the next episode, because this one has gone on long enough. Let's... before we do, let's speak to the hunter. May the beasts answer your calling, Onol Manawi. You are a brave hunter. The village will at last find peace once again. Simple enough. Either way, our mission here is complete. Next episode, we'll speak with the healer and take him back to Constantine. At long last, we'll be going back to see him. Hopefully we can at least ease things for him. But that'll be in the next episode. So, until then, I'm Chester44, that is Deserde, Petrus, and Siora. This has been a Let's Play of Greedfall, and I shall see you all next time.